The aviation industry will need more than 600,000 new pilots over the next 20 years, that according to a recent forecast by Boeing. So this is an industry that has been through a lot of turmoil in recent years. 8 News Now reporter Brian Will takes us inside the world of aviation to show us what's being done to address the issue right here in Las Vegas. The guys that were flying back then are now retiring all, all at once. Okay, that's one thing. Number two is the, the demand for air travel has skyrocketed. And number three, third world countries that weren't even doing that much flying are flying like every day. Ron Kelly and his company, Las Vegas Flight Academy, helped train pilots. But now he has a more important mission of inspiring the next generation to take to the skies. We're going into the inner cities to the schools to bring in more women and minorities into aviation. And the number one thing I get from them is that they don't even know that this is a possibility for them. And once they do, their eyes go like this. Airlines like Las Vegas-based Allegiant are also creating pathways for people to become pilots. Partnerships with four-year universities that have 141 flight schools. We have a great partnership with Spartan. That's our altitude program. It's kind of what traditionally is called the zero to hero program. It's a flight school will take you from no flight time all the way through your commercial. A lot of people may not know that some of the flight training for Allegiant happens right here in Las Vegas. And I got to hop in the pilot seat for an inside look inside this flight simulator. To the strip on our right hand side. So now you're gonna go ahead and roll to the left until you can get that bar back. And you're gonna pitch down to get that horizontal bar back onto that yellow square. It does come with long hours and it's intensive training. Some things that people don't realize, not only is there a lot of training for, it's not just right, one and okay. done, it's throughout okay. your entire career. Um, it's a skill set that you hone over and over and over again. There's also a medical component to it. It takes about a year to get your certificates and ratings, but then you need to get up to 1,500 hours before you can take the controls of an airline. Hey. Nice landing. <laughs> Safe and sound. Flight schools and aircraft rental company All In Aviation hosting an open house event in an effort to showcase STEM careers in aviation. It is at the Henderson Executive Airport Thursday at 4 p.m.